Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. The honorable juries, the respectable committee of the English Speech Contest, my fellow participants, and all the audience. Good afternoon. How are you? First of all, I'd like to introduce myself. My name is Chris Hasha Karina, and today. My discussion will be about how to use social media wisely. Ladies and gentlemen, let me start my speech with a few questions. Do you have Facebook on your mobile phone? Do you have YouTube? What about WhatsApp? I myself have, and I think everyone here does. Facebook with 2.8 billion users followed by YouTube and WhatsApp have become the top three social media in the world as of October 2021. What does it mean? It means that now we are connected with billions of people in the universe. If we are wise, this connection could be a great way to support our success. But if we are not, it can cause a great disaster to our lives. Today, let me share you four tips on how to use social media wisely. First, have positive intention. Ladies and gentlemen, when we decide to use social media, make sure we have positive intentions, such as maintaining good communication, building friendship, sharing and increasing our knowledge, boost our life skills, and perhaps Start an online business. Never ever intend to use social media for negative things, such as showing off or spread toxic ideas to other people. That's my first tip. The second tip is think before we post. Before posting anything, think deeply whether it will bring back impact. Remember, Everything we post will have digital records that can be tracked in the future. Even today, many companies use social media to track online activities of people who want to work with them. So, think really carefully before posting anything. The third tip is keep our privacy. Privacy means anything that should be kept private and not exposed to others such as passcode, password, pictures or videos showing private parts of our body. Never share our private information to anyone, even with the ones we know well. Remember, they can make use of our private information for their own benefits, and we don't want it to happen to us, right? So, keep our privacy private. My last tip is manage our time well. Ladies and gentlemen, according to socialbody.com, a teenager spends around nine hours each day to access social media. Don't you think that nine hours is too much? Remember, as teenagers, besides our online activities, we also have a social life with the real community. So, by managing our time well, hopefully, both our online and offline lives are balanced. Ladies and gentlemen, those are my four tips on how to use social media wisely. They are having positive intention, thinking before posting, keeping our privacy, and managing our time well. So everyone, Let's be wise users. Control your social media and don't let social media control you. Be yourselves and don't let social media change the real you. Thank you so much for your attention. Wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.